should I handle finances? Let the men take care of all this. It is not my job to look after finances. I don't know anything about money. How many things am I supposed to handle? My husband is handling it now. Why should I bother now? He will take care of me. How many of us have had these or similar thoughts when we think of handling our finances? Do you also think this way or have been thinking, why do we women need to learn to manage our own money? Then I welcome you to listen in. First, I'm sharing why women shun away from learning about finances, managing their own money. So the top reasons. Number one, they are scared to venture into a new territory. Scared to learn something new. Finances seem like rocket science to them. Number two, they have a fear of numbers. Number three, they prefer the men in their life should do it because that's how it has always been. Number four, they also feel if they do it, men will look down upon them or they will attract some sarcasm or be made fun of. Number five, men discourage them saying this is not for you. I am doing it. Why do you need to do this? Men say, am I not taking care of you? What are you trying to show by doing this? Some of them also feel threatened. Some women want to avoid any confrontation and maintain peace at home. So they say, ghar mein jhagde honge, so rehne do. These are just some of the reasons and there are many more which we could deep dive in together. So now, now that we have some reasons on why women don't take charge of their finances, so what's the need? Why should we as women even do this? Why do we need to actually take charge of our finances? Is it important? I think, in fact, Irrespective of gender, everyone should get financial education. It is one of the essential life skills like cooking, learning the English language and it is all the more necessary for women. So let me share the top four reasons with you. Number one, women outlive men. Data from WHO for 2018 for India says that average life expectancy of a woman is 70.3 years and that of a man is 67.4. So women live longer than men and will need to have their money for longer years than men. Given this scenario, how long will they be dependent on men for their money? First father, then husband, then son. What if someone is not able to take care of them? Then who does she depend on? Extended family? Instead of depending on others, why not depend on yourself? Because the consequences of being dependent on others is that we will be compromising on our lifestyle in the later stages of our life. Second point, women earn 20% less compared to men in similar jobs. The work tenure of a woman is shorter than men because women need to take many breaks during their career journey. Like ailing parents, marriage, kids, health of family and so on. In such a situation, they lose precious years worth of earning. If they don't take care of the income which they have and invest it wisely, imagine the loss they are facing. Third point, no knowledge of investing. Even if the women are earning or they are homemakers, they don't have any investing knowledge. Could be by choice or due to our social conditioning. But this means that we need to be dependent on others for her investing needs. And lastly, less retirement fund. Because of different income slabs for men and women, breaks in their career and no knowledge of investing, women end up with way less retirement fund than the men. 
now since the women outlive the men and since they have less income less savings than men isn't it very important that we know about our investments and finance management even if we women have lesser money if we learn how to invest efficiently save smartly we will be able to create the money for our future and lead a comfortable life like we are leading right now in our community we are constantly working to empower every woman with the financial knowledge so that she is not dependent on others and can take care of not only herself but her family too because we believe when we empower one woman we empower the entire family i clearly see that as women we have two choices either we continue to be dependent on our husband father brother or financial advisors or we financially educate ourselves so that we are not dependent on anyone else we are confident and feel empowered to take our independent decisions about money now it is up to you to choose your choice will build your future see you around